Ha ha! This week we have our first collab with a fellow YouTuber in the treehouse! Okay friends, welcome back to the treehouse, where we're working together with Issa Wilson and her brother Max. Have you ever had someone you didn't get along with? Maybe a brother or a sister or someone from your school or from your neighborhood? Well, what did you do? Yell and scream at them? Throw stuff? Push them down? Or did you just run away? Issa and Max have a great idea on something maybe you can try when you have someone you aren't getting along with or if there's someone you think is different from you. Let's watch and see if we can learn from them. Hi guys, it's Issa and it's Matt. And today we are going to be talking about the importance of getting along with your sibling. Ugh. I have to spend time with you. Like, what am I even supposed to do with you? Um, I guess we could play Legos. No way I'm gonna do Legos. How about we draw? Um, we can pull, we can make a movie. Actually, I want to do that. Sure. Yeah, let's go. See, because me and Max were able to find common ground and both doing something that we both enjoy, we were able to create movies together. And that was our common ground. We also play sports together. We make food together, we make videos, we watch shows together, we do everything together. All because we found common ground. And I love my sister. That was our way of bonding. And that's how Jesus intends it to be. According to Ephesians 4.32, Be kind to one another, tender-hearted, forgiving one another, just as God in Christ forgave you. See, we need to be kind to one another because that's how we're supposed to live and that's what makes Jesus happy. So now kids, I challenge you to find common ground with your siblings, just as we did. Now back to Mr. Rob Susan. Bye. Bye. Whoa, now that's a great thing to think about. Common ground. There's always something we can find that we have in common with someone else. Maybe it's a love for Lego or a love for making movies, a love for reading books, or a love for playing sports, or a love for playing video games. And if you can't find anything you have in common, there's one more thing that we all have in common, and that's God's love. I'll read a scripture to you, tell you what I mean. He's had a great scripture from Ephesians, and I have one from the book of John. God loved the world so much that he gave his one and only son Anyone who believes in him will not die, but will have eternal life. Friends, did you hear that? God loved the world and everybody in it so much that he sent his son so that we could live with him forever in heaven together, forever and ever and ever. God loves every person, including you, including me, including that person that you don't always get along with. So what does that mean to us? Well, for one, God sees each person, you and me and everyone else, as a wonderful creation made in God's image. And he gave us incredible gifts and talents. And each of us have a very unique and special purpose in this life. So there's some common ground right there that we are all created and loved by God. Everyone needs to feel loved. And that's common ground. You can share this common ground by expressing love and kindness to the people around you. Work hard to love people who are different from you or the people who aren't always easy to love. When you do this, they see something shine out from inside of you. That's God's love. And that is some common ground worth sharing, right? I'm so glad you joined me in the treehouse today. 
Thanks to Issa Wilson and her brother Max. If you want to check out her YouTube channel, the link will be in the description below. Okay, Treehouse friends, read your Bible, keep loving and worshiping God, love others, and tell everybody about Jesus. He loves you, and I do too. Bye-bye. <laughs>